Hi Pisces, how y'all doing? Welcome back to my channel. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is your freaking weekend messages for June 24th through the 26th. I'm going to take a look into your romance, love, and sexual lives to see what you can expect for the weekend. Okay, Pisces, these are general messages, so if they don't resonate, check back with me. Or they're just not for you, baby, but that's okay. Cross watcher, if I say you're doing this, you're feeling this way, you're saying this, but it's your Pisces, please flip it. Pisces, if I say that it's you, you're doing this, or you're feeling this way, and it's really your cross watcher, please flip it. I'm open for personal readings. You can email me. You can follow me on all my social media so I can keep up with y'all. Um, if you like these readings or my energy in any way, go ahead and leave me a thumbs up and subscribe, y'all. So I'm going to pull from the um, Romance Angels first. Thank you, ancestors and guides, for giving me a message for Pisces. What's going on for Pisces? Pisces, sun, moon, rising, and Venus, okay? Or anyone with Pisces in their chart, okay? What's going on? Too many, okay. Give me one message, please, for Pisces. Pisces. There we go. Trust. So this weekend, or just the general message, have some trust. The situation is calling for you to have trust. Okay, so I'm saying you have to really trust someone to be passionate with them. You have to have a lot of trust for someone. The situation is calling for you to have faith. Have faith in your person. Have faith in yourself. Maybe you haven't been sexual in, in have not been sexual in a while. Okay, or maybe you've just been burned too many times. Um, could be literally or, you know, just theoretically. Um. But it's, they're saying have trust, okay? This could be just a random message that don't have anything to do with the spread. But trust is a factor, okay? Have some faith. Whether it be faith in yourself or, you know, get you a faithful person. So I'm going to pull some messages from my decks. So these um, messages will indicate who this person may be. What they feel about you. Um, what they want from you and how they feel and their intentions okay thank you ancestors and guides for giving me a message for pisces did i say this was for pisces okay just making sure i hope i announced y'all my brain almost went blank <laughs> okay pisces sun moon rising and venus um you guys check the aquarius read because you popped up in aquarius's read i was getting aquarii pie energies Okay. Um, also Leo as well. You could be dealing with a Leo. Alright, what's going on for Pisces? Okay, this wants to come out. It says, I can't leave my boyfriend. Someone cannot leave their boyfriend. Okay. Whatever that means. So this is why you don't have enough trust in the situation. And look, Leo's coming out. I told you you could be dealing with the Leo. Um, someone says they can't leave their boyfriend or someone can't leave their girlfriend. But I have a I can't leave my girlfriend card. Since it didn't come out, I'm going to stick with boyfriend, okay? Someone can't leave their boyfriend. What else for Pisces, please? So that's, that's probably why you're trying to have trust in the situation. Like, oh my gosh, I'm already in something. I'm just going to trust that the universe works this out. I'm having feelings for someone else or, you know, I can't leave this person. I'm trying to do this or do that, whatever it may be. You could be dealing with a Virgo. Anything else for Pisces? <sighs> my back. My neck. My back. Okay, sorry, y'all. <laughs> Anything else for Pisces? Okay, this is your sign to leave her alone, little bro. Damn. They really coming after the women or the feminine. So someone can't leave their boyfriend. And this is your sign to leave her alone, little bro. Damn. This is your sign to leave her alone. If y'all want, y'all can flip it. This may be your sign to leave him alone. But this is, this is specific, y'all. This is very specific. I'm in love with someone else. Yeah, it's specific. This person who can't leave their boyfriend, they're in love with someone else. So maybe 
You could have met this person while they were on a break with their person and you fell in love with them, but they went back to their person and mended things. And it's like, now you can't leave them alone. You fell in love with them, but they can't leave their boyfriend. So somebody, so someone and their partner, they break up, come back together, break up and come back together. But when they break up, they deal with other people and get other innocent people involved. Okay, false advertisement. So you thought this person had it all together. Um, you thought you could trust this person or whatever it is that they sold you was false advertisement. Yeah, multiple partners. So someone has multiple partners. This is very specific, y'all. You are my twin flame. So, but someone feels like the other person is their twin flame. Okay? Someone may really want to... Maybe this was a cycle for this person. Leaving their person, coming back to their person. Leaving their person, coming back to their person. And when they were gone from their person, they would make connections with other people. But when they came across you... They didn't really want to go back to their person, but they were so used to the cycle, you know. It became a way of life for them now. And now that they've met you, you may be their twin flame, but they're stuck in the cycle. Or whatever. I'm not giving them no excuses, okay. I know I was wrong, now I'm paying the price. Okay. Someone knows they were wrong and they are paying the price. If you were ever wondering, are they getting their karma? If you were ever wondering, did they get their, you know, their uh, just dues? Yeah, they're paying the price. And they know they messed up. I know I messed up. They know. They, even if they act like, oh, it's fine. Oh, I, did, I don't know what you're talking about. It's not that bad. Trying to water the situation down. No, they know they messed up. They say, how can I fix this? Okay. Damn. Y'all got a specific message. Okay. We have a karmic masculine popping out. So someone could be dealing with a karmic masculine. Who they is chewing the feminine up. She's a player, little bro. They is chewing her up. This is specific, y'all. But someone says, I know we are meant to be together. We are meant to be together. That's how somebody feels. That's what somebody's saying. So all of this could be being revealed to you this weekend. <sighs> Y'all tell me what's going on in the comments, okay? <laughs> all right, so this is your freaking weekend messages. So the 18 plus content is coming up. Um, these messages were just to give you a hint on who this person was or maybe give you confirmation. Um, take the messages as they resonate. If none of this resonated, I do have my other deck that I'll be pulling from. So, viewer discretion advice because this is 18 plus content and there is vulgar content. There's vulgar language, okay? All right. What's going on this weekend for my Pisces, please? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Pisces, Pisces. Okay. I did it on purpose so we could have makeup sex. Yeah, somebody, what the fuck? So somebody goes back and forth between people or some shit? I don't know. It don't have to be going back and forth between people, but somebody does something on purpose so y'all can have makeup sex. Okay, what the fuck? So you're going to find this out this weekend or this is happening this weekend. Somebody's doing something on purpose so y'all can have makeup sex this weekend. Okay, you're going to be finding out someone is possessive over you. Okay, if you didn't know, now you know. Okay, I'm pretty sure y'all knew. I tempt you on purpose. Who the fuck is this? You could be dealing with an Aquarius. I tempt you on purpose. So this person does shit on purpose. See, I can have makeup sex and they tempt you on, on purpose. And they're possessive over you or you're possessive over them. Yeah, I, I see why you're possessive over them. They be doing this crazy ass shit. Somebody, somebody, wow, boy, they wow. I make up any excuse to call you. Pisces be having people going crazy. I, I had a, one of my best friends was a Pisces man. And I never seen women act like that. The way, the way he had them women acting. I make up any excuse to call you. Yeah, this motherfucker possesses. They gonna call your ass. Hey, just giving you a call. I just talked to you two seconds ago, but I need to call you. Okay? 
I need to hear your voice. Huh? <laughs> ring, ring, motherfucker. I only want sex. So somebody only wants sex. I feel like this person cannot make up their mind. Okay? I feel like this person lets sex dictate their emotions and actions and how they treat people. So they use sex as a way to characterize people and generalize people. So sex with you means you're this. Sex with them means they're that. Some shit like that could be done with the Capricorn. Okay, we do have I'm possessive over you and we have obsessed. We, have, we I can just tell there's obsession here. But Capricorn represents toxicity. Not Capricorn, but you know, Capricorn, the devil card, toxicity. Okay. Anything else? What's happening this weekend for Pisces? What are my freak nasty Pisces getting into this weekend? All right. Okay. Anything else? So somebody does stuff on purpose so y'all have makeup sex. Someone is possessive. Someone tempts the other person on purpose. Someone makes up an excuse to call. Okay. It says, I masturbate beforehand so I last longer. So you're masturbating before you see this person so you last longer or this person is masturbating before they see you so they'll last longer. Yeah, you probably got some good sex so they got some good sex and this person just crazy as fuck over the sex. Not crazy as fuck in a bad way, but you know, good sex do things to you. Okay? Good sex do things to you. Have you acting all types of ways. Alright, anything else for Pisces? I think about fucking you all the time. So this person is always thinking about fucking you. Okay? Always. If you ever wonder what this person is thinking, they're probably thinking about fucking you. Okay? You could be in mid-conversation with this person and all they're thinking about is fucking you. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Someone with Gemini in their chart. So we have Capricorn coming out, Gemini coming out. Okay, it says this dick is toxic or this pussy is toxic. Oh, Lord. This person probably got some... Oh, Lord, have mercy. They probably got some steal your soul dick. Some steal your soul pussy. Okay. That shit don't feel like anything on this earth. Okay. <laughs> that shit gotta be magic. So y'all are having a quickie this weekend? Okay, I'm seeing that you, shit, some of you probably don't even want to fuck with this person, but the sex is so good. You you can't help it. You end up having a quickie with them. Somebody wants to put their thumb in it. Okay, somebody wants to put their thumb in it. The Ruta or the Tuta, okay? So this weekend, y'all are having quickies. You're finding out somebody dick or pussy is toxic. You, you find out somebody thinks about fucking you all day. Somebody's going to be masturbating before this quickie, so they'll last longer. Okay? This weekend, somebody could be doing candle magic. I think Capricorn is coming out because that full moon is in Capricorn, too. A lot of shit is going down. Okay? Wet my beard. So, somebody's wetting your beard or you're wetting someone's beard. So, y'all getting head, giving some head. I was getting some head. I come fast when you throw it back, so somebody be throwing it back. And they know what they're doing. They know what they're doing. They make you come fast on purpose. Okay? Because y'all have to have this quickie. Where y'all doing this at? <sighs> What's going on for my Pisces, please? Pisces, someone rising Venus. I'm toxic. Whoop. Oh, Lord. Whoop. There it is. Somebody is toxic. The sex with them is so good. I'm not condoning it. I'm just saying. I'm your tarot reader. I got to tell you. <sighs> shit, this how y'all feel. They toxic, but they dick is so good. Or they toxic, but that wop is so good. Damn. You could have been fucking with this person for a long time. I love the way you taste. I told wet my beard. I love the way you taste. You can't make this up. Somebody got that wop. Somebody been eating their pineapple. Somebody look. Somebody is fresh than a motherfucker. I love the way you taste. Y'all getting head this weekend. I'm talking head, head. Wet my beard. Y'all are getting head. Because we have oral sex. 
I was getting some head, getting, getting some head. Okay, somebody told, you make somebody toes curl. You make somebody toes curl. You know how crazy I am about you. Yeah, we know. We know. This person crazy as hell. They possessive over you. They crazy as hell. All of it. All of it. Okay? The works. The works. Okay? Anything else for Pisces, please? What's going on? What my freaky Pisces doing this weekend? What are my freaky Pisces doing this weekend? All right. My freak nasties. Okay? I dream about you. So you're dreaming about someone this weekend or someone is dreaming about you. And that's probably what, uh, shit, that's probably what start this shit up. I can't stop dreaming about this motherfucker. Could be dealing with an Aries. I didn't know how wet you got. So somebody has the mop. The mop. <laughs> the fucking mop. I meant the wop. <laughs> so bring the mop and the mop bucket, damn it. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't know. I just didn't know how wet you got, Pisces. Damn. I brought the mop bucket. I brought it. Can you please wet this wet his beard? Okay. We have car sex. So y'all could be doing it. And doing it and doing it doing it doing it in the car I just want to please you I can't stay so yeah y'all are having that quickie remember and this person just wants to please you they can't stay oh y'all might be having unprotected sex this weekend okay all right I like when you run from this dick so y'all running from that dick this weekend someone is running from that dick this weekend they like that shit. Somebody wants you and needs you. Somebody probably really does feel like they need you. They need your sex. Your need your sexual healing. I hate when you leave. Yeah, I just want to please you. I can't stay, but they hate when you leave. <sighs> Give me a little more, please. Okay, I'll take these two. I need an outlet. Yeah, they need an outlet. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. Watch the Aquarius reading. You tame my wild side. Yeah, this person who needs an outlet, they have a wild side that you tame. That's why you guys just keep coming back and forth to each other or some shit like that. Anything else for Pisces? All right, this is the, from the Tarot of Sex Magic. For Pisces, please. Anything else for Pisces? Could definitely be dealing with an Aries. Damn, you got the Emperor and the Ace of Wands? This is big daddy dick. This is Big mama wop, okay? This motherfucker, ooh, Lord. I see why you, the Ace of Wands, so y'all definitely getting it, getting in there. Getting in there like somewhere. This could be a father, a husband, a boss, someone older than you, but someone is, someone knows how to work that wand. Do you see how he got that wand in his hand? He know what he doing. Y'all gonna be naked as fuck. Okay, shawty want a thug. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, this person, you have a wild side. You have a wild side feminine and this masculine tames your wild side. Or uh, masculine, you have a wild side and this feminine. I think that's what it is. This feminine has a wild side. Even though she may be tied to someone else, she just does it for you. She, it, she gives you fun, excitement. Fan, she fulfills your fantasies or Take it how it resonates, but emperor could be the empress. They know exactly how to please you in every single way. With the ace of wands, this shit gonna be good this weekend. I wish y'all could tell me how it is, but I love y'all. I'll see y'all later. Check the description box. Don't forget to give me a like and subscribe. I'll see y'all in y'all next reading, Pisces. I also did your general readings for July, so check those out too. Peace out.